Hello, this is Robert from Shape Web Designs and Hosting. I'm going to show you right now how to create um, a contact form for uh, your Joomla website. Um, it's very easy to do. Uh, actually, there's a lot. No, there's not any problems whatsoever that will cause you not to be able to do it. Right now, we're looking at say, as you can see, I've got the home button in there about us, our menu, rainy days cafe, uh, rainy days recipes. So sorry. And what we're going to do is we're going to create the contact uh, page. In Joomla, it has its own uh, contact module that's already in the component area. All you do is go to contacts. You click on contacts. And the first thing you need to do is you need to create a category. So you go in and you create a new category. And what you do is you give it the category. The name is, is we'll just name it uh, Rainy Days. contact all right and then you just hit save and close there you got your category rainy days right there okay now we're gonna do your contacts now there's different ways of doing this now if you have multiple contacts you can set out multiple contacts um, I'm just gonna actually show you the basic uh, way of setting it up so let's do contact so now that we do new and and we say contact, uh, the name of it's uh, contact, rainy days. Cafe. Just like that. And then basically you're going to select the category right here. Uh, you don't have to link a user to it or not, nothing like that. Then you go down here, over here, you leave this, actually you leave this part alone. You don't need to do anything here. And you hit contact details. If you want to put a logo in there, um, you can do that by selecting this and choosing a logo, or you can upload it to your area. The position of the logo, okay? So we're going to actually put uh, the email address, and it's uh, info at uh, rainy days cafe. Uh, sorry about that. Just like that you can actually put the address in here um, you can put the state you can put this you know this is uh, the state the zip code and you can put the telephone number we're just gonna do this basically we're gonna do uh, a very very clean all right now we're just gonna do a simple contact page for right now so I can show you how to do it uh, go ahead and you can hit save and close okay then you're gonna go over here to your menu area you're going to click on main menus, all right? And you're going to hit new. And you're going to select what kind of a button it is. It's going to be a single contact, just like that. And you say uh, contact us is usually the what everybody likes to read, okay? And then you select contact over here, and that's rain days, okay? Uh, contact display options. I always tell people uh, the best way to do this, display format. Uh, let's just do plain, okay, just like that. And it's real simple to do. And you can go in here and you can tell what you want it to show. If, if you don't want it to show, and you can also create other links if you want it on your contact page. You can do that all through here. You can also do a V card right here, which we will be doing for this customer down the road here. Uh, it's, it's really easy to do a uh, V card. So we'll get that information in your in a little while so anyway uh, we do have basically we have it all set up we're ready to go and this is what it looks like so you just hit click save and you come over here you refresh the page like this you'll see contact us and voila there you go you got a simple contact page uh, easy to do uh, not hard to do actually and you can do it in different various ways like you can have separate like I said you can do multiple contacts for a company or something like that it does have where you can create different categories different departments and stuff like that it, it does have capabilities to grow it, it can be very robust or it can be very easy I recommend for small websites keep it simple and that's pretty much it thank you for uh, listening this is Robert from uh, from shape web designs and hosting thank you